Hey guys, for Complex News, I'm Natasha Martinez. Self-proclaimed pharma bro Martin Shkreli, who infamously raised the price of a life-saving HIV drug and bought the one-of-a-kind Wu-Tang Clan album, has been sentenced to seven years in prison for securities fraud. According to the Associated Press, U.S. District Judge Kiyo Matsumoto heard arguments in Brooklyn, New York Friday on how long Shkreli should spend in jail, ultimately deciding on seven years after initially suggesting 15. Those at the scene say Shkreli cried during the sentencing, apologizing to his investors and admitting that he'd made a lot of mistakes in his career. His attorney tried to argue that Shkreli deserved only 18 months or less in prison on the basis of that he shouldn't be punished for having a big mouth. But he also said that he wanted to punch Shkreli in the face, so there's that. Shkreli was recently ordered to forfeit his stake in the $2 million Wu-Tang album Once Upon a Time in Shaolin, as well as what may or may not be Lil Wayne's The Carter Five. That's your news for now. For more on this and the rest of today's story, subscribe to Complex on YouTube. For Complex News, I'm Natasha Martinez.